Hi, my name is John Kaufman, and I'm directing A Man's a Man by Brecht. The story underneath it's about a man whose identity is, is taken from him by forces outside of himself that he's all too quick to give over to. Uh, Widow Begbick, her sexuality takes him over this way. Uh, Bloody Five, this sergeant character, his bullying and his militaristic uh, style pull him in that way. You've got uh, these sort of army connivers, Polly and Jesse, who are uh, a fun comic duo in the play, but for the purposes of the story, are also pulling pulling Gayla Gay into their world as well with with threats and giving him money and, and bribing him. Gay, Gay, a simple waterfront porter who goes off in the morning to buy a fish and gets a little sidetracked along the way, ends up joining the army, uh, buying a fake elephant and selling it to Widow Begbick and really basically taking over the watching somebody become a man that he is clearly not and how easy it is to, to lose one's identity in that way. Anthony Nelson, I'm director of Waiting for Lefty, written in 1935, first put on by the group theater at the beginning of the Federal Theater Project. Um, it's a very uh, topical play about it. It ties into what's going on today with uh, employees. For example, my father, he, uh, he works for a college up in northern Iowa. Him, he's not full time, and they're giving him 16 hours a week right now to, to live on. I think a lot of Americans are dealing with the same topic. Uh, that's what the play sort of deals with. It's uh, the control that somebody who can employ people has over, uh, over those people. And that's what the play deals with. And I think that America now is finally sort of... It, it's funny, Clifford Odets, he was actually an actor. Because he, he actually played one of the roles in the original production. He played Dr. Benjamin. And Dr. Benjamin has the big moment in the play where he stands with the fists and he says, let's unite America. Oh, I think Odets was really tapping into uh, what, what was going on in America. And, you know, it's funny how we, we sort of, we've had history edited for us. My name is Sarah Palama. I am directing The Congresswoman by Aristophanes. Yeah, the story is about um, the women of Athens who are sick and tired of the corruption of the government, especially this new practice of mixing money and politics. So they decide to disguise themselves as men, sneak into Congress, give a rallying speech, and have Congress vote women into power and take over society. Make this very, very ancient text pop for audiences today. The the delight that the actors have found in playing these very extreme comic characters and just watching them make a choice and then take it to an extreme. I bought you with a cellar here upon this cask I'm seated. That choice is one that hearts can dear to me is freely beaten. enjoy it and be amazed at how dirty the jokes were before the beginning of the millennia.